framework today. You got your basic kind of framework today. So tomorrow, we're just going to get back to a lot of the same positions and just dive a lot deeper. But what we're going to do right now is I want you to start working on your scramble sequence. So some we started a, a long time ago doing our, rest, our scramble camps, and it's kind of progressed into all our other technical systems. You get with your partner, and you all build a choreographed scramble sequence. The only, the only thing that I ask you to do is it has to be 85% scrambling technique. But by the end of the day tomorrow, you'll have twice as much technique that you learned today and you'll just keep adding to it. So I'll give you a couple chances tomorrow to work on your routine. I don't care how many moves it is. It doesn't have to be 40 moves. It can be four moves. But when I give you a chance to work on it, I want you to work on it. It does a couple things. Make you and your partner work together, communicate position and think without me telling you and turning you into a robot. Two, it's kind of fun. And three, it makes you problem solve. I'm real big on problem solving because that's all life and wrestling and a lot of stuff is. Just figuring out a solution to a challenge. So you're going to just walk yourself through a bunch of different scramble sequences and positions. All right? And you're just going to keep adding layers to it. And again, everybody's is going to be different. I don't care if it's 100% scrambling. But it can be 85% scrambling and 15% kung fu fighting. Doesn't matter to me. All right? But I want you to focus mainly on the scramble aspect. You can have backflips and fireballs and RKOs. It doesn't matter to me. Right? I want you to be super creative. Right? But I want you to build these scramble sequences. So you can start however you want, finish however you want. But we're going to add to it tomorrow and at the end of camp. We'll watch everybody show off their scramble sequences and it'll be a good validation of what you learned. But it'll be something you did, not something I, I planned out for you. Does that make sense to everybody? So it's a planned, choreographed sequence. So if I told you to go make up a dance routine, you would have to go rehearse it and plan it and walk through it. So don't just go out there and wing it right now. I want you to talk and walk through positions. So you got about got about six minutes to work on it. Go. <laughs> 